Hi guys, happy Sunday! It is Sunday, you guys. I have not vlogged, like I told you guys before, in a very long time. But, what am I doing? Grabbing my She Beauty um, in the color Goddess. Um, baby girl and I, I love how she drinks her bottle and puts it in a cup holder now. Look at her. She's such a big girl. Anyway, um, baby girl and I are about to run out and um, complete some errands while daddy cuts the grass and puts a few things on the grill for the rest of the week at least that's what he said he doing but right now i see football on i um, and then later on i'm gonna come back and drop her off with him and mommy is going to go to my friend's birthday luncheon at her house um this afternoon so yeah the errands we have to run you guys hold on I'm not using a lip liner or anything today because I just needed to hurry up and put something on. My lips was looking a little bit too bare. I'm going to have to get that side. Anyway. Hold on. Y'all. Anywho. Um, the errands that I have to run, let me get a baby wipe down here because y'all know I keep those on deck. They fix all problems. Um, first of all, y'all like my hat? Ronnie bought me this hat from this local vendor. Um, he has like all the colors, but it's basically a DC. They also have Maryland ones too, but the Maryland ones, I think are University of Maryland or something. And y'all know I went to Howard, so I ain't about to wear that, but Ronnie wears it. Um, but anyway, and he ain't go to Maryland, but he don't care. Anyway, the errands that we have to run today are, you can see I have a huge bin, storage bin in the back seat of the car, and the trunk is full as well, so I can't buy much today. Those are all of my, um, traditional color fall decor that I'm giving to my brother and sister-in-law, so Ronnie packed them up in the car, but I have so much more to take over there for the fall fest. We're having a family fall fest, we do it annually last year was the first year and we're going to go bigger and better this year so um i'm giving her all of my traditional theme fall decor because i repurchased everything this year in the blue white silvers and gray tones um so i'm packing all that up she is going to give me my bins back because i need to pack up my new stuff once it's time to pack that up and decorate for christmas but for right now i'm going to drop all that stuff off i'm not going to drop that off while i have baby girl though i think once i drop her off with ronnie i'm going to you know um go to my luncheon and then drop it off at my brother's house afterwards because my friend lives in my old neighborhood which is really close to my parents neighborhood and you guys know my brother lives off the same road as my parents so um i'm gonna do that later but that's why i have the bins in here i am headed to annapolis maryland i gotta go to the mall because i ordered these flats i ordered two pair of flats but i decided to keep one pair because they weren't that bad and i wore them to as pool slides um, when we went to costa rica the other pair i want to send back i only paid like eight or ten dollars for them but i'm already going to that store which is forever 21 because i ordered a jumpsuit um to wear as my airport outfit when we go out of town for my birthday coming up um so i need to pick that up and because i was going in the store i brought this pair of shoes to just see if they would return it i mean it's been a month because i picked them up before we left but we'll see or maybe they'll give me a store credit or maybe they won't because maybe they were on sale and maybe they were final sale um I ordered a nine and I just don't like the way they fit. I don't like when my, sh my foot is all the way up at the bottom of it, you know, and that's kind of how it is. Um, so I'll show you guys these in a second. And then also today is the last day of the Bath and Body Works um, wallflower um, sale where they're 325 I think. So I want to get um, maybe about $40 worth of those just to stock up because um, like you guys know, if you've been following me for a while, um, we host Christmas um for our both of our families um every year well last year was the first year we hosted because that was the first year and a, we had a house big enough um but we're gonna try to make it an annual thing so we're gonna do it again this year and i've been um 
I want to stock up on the things that I know I'm going to, you know, go through when we have company. So I'm probably going to plug in my plugins like one or two days before everybody arrives. And then I'll let them burn throughout the holiday weekend. Um, but I'm going to need to refresh them. These are the ones I really wanted, but I have to send them back because they're not long enough. Like, I feel like my foot is right at the end of them. And I've ordered a nine. That's the size I wear, but maybe I should have got a 10. Ebony has a 10. My friend Ebony has these same shoes and she has a 10. And she said she only wore them once and they were uncomfortable. So she said she'd give them to me. I don't really need them um, per se because I've been purchasing shoes like crazy and stuff for vacation. But I mean, if she's going to throw them out, I'll take them because I did order them and they didn't fit. So I'm going to send those back. I think I may have paid $10 for them. Not that much. Um, and then um, pick up the jumpsuit, which I'll show you guys later on in the vlog. And then, like I said, we're going to go to Bath and Body Works. I have to go to Target as well because I purchased Baby Girl. I've been getting her ready for the fall season. And I purchased her um, some long sleeve like onesies to go under her clothes and I purchased by mistake a 12 month instead of two of the 18 months so I need to exchange that from Target and then what else do we need to do there's something else while I'm in Target I need to get a storage bin for some of her clothes that are too small um what is this and then there was something else that we needed to do I don't remember I'm trying to avoid going in and out and in and out and in and out. But anyway, um, I'm going to pop into Home Goods. Oh, that's what I got to do. I got to pop into Home Goods in Annapolis because, you guys, the curtains that I ordered for the, the okay, if you guys watch my very first fall home decor haul of this season, I showed you guys some really nice navy blue curtains for the sunroom. I told you guys I wanted to get the acrylic rods from Ballard Designs, which I'm still going to order. Um, and I wanted to hang the blue curtains in there. But then I realized when I was showing them on video to you guys that they had the silver grommets. And I didn't want the grommets because I want to use like the curtain rings clips to hang them on the rod. And the grommets just, I didn't, I didn't like the look. One of you guys sent me a picture of the same curtains hung up by the grommet um by the ring clips and i didn't really like the look for the look i was going for so i decided to return those curtains and no, then no. i and then i ordered some That's really <laughs> right you want your horsey here poops um then i ordered some really nice um what i thought was navy blue curtains that were like four times the price they were like sixty dollars for a set of two whereas the other ones i had were like 24.99 i don't know something like that so it was almost triple the price but anyway i ordered them from tjmax.com and they came last night you guys they are really really nice quality i bought the 96 inches one they were nine really nice quality but the blue was not a true like deep navy blue so as soon as I opened the box, I was so upset because I waited like a week and some change for them to come. So I still have to return those to TJ Maxx because I need my hundred and eighty some dollars back. But the day before that, <laughs> I went into <laughs> she is talking today. The day before that, I went into Home Goods, you guys, in my area, and I found two sets of a hundred and eight inch velvet royal blue or not royal blue navy blue curtains 108 inch though so i have to hang them pretty high to the ceiling which is okay um 108 inches really nice um velvet navy blue right with the pocket rod in the tabs so um i don't have to worry about the grommets they were only $19.99 they're by the brand indigo loft right they were only $19.99 but they only had two sets and of course I need three sets because I have I'm putting up three sets of curtains in there so I want to pop into home goods in Annapolis and see I don't want to go on that binge like I did for the wall decor and go to eight home goods in like two days I don't want to do that but funny fact while I was in the home goods in my area where I found the curtains that I'm going to keep I saw four of the silver 
wall decor the cheaper ones that i had originally bought three of and i was on the hunt for one more i couldn't find it for like two weeks now my local store had four of them out on display i said i should have waited i should have waited but had i waited they wouldn't have had it like this color is popping y'all goddess she beauty she's gonna restock soon anyway um yeah like i was like um what in the world but I had already bought the replacement once that I went ahead and went with, which was my original design anyway. So I said, forget it. But anyway, um, I got to go to Home Goods just for a second. Um, and that's pretty much it. And then I'm going to head back and drop her off. He should be done cutting the grass and hopefully grilling some food. He's going to like kind of meal prep, like grill uh, enough food to get us through at least half the week because we have been eating out y'all and we have not been eating good. I've been doing good for the last two days. I've been going back to keto because I need to slim it down before my birthday. So yeah. Um, also I took out all of my old, not my old, but the stuff I already had for fall decor in the color schemes the silvers the whites the blues the grays i took all that out last night this morning i took out all of the stuff that i hauled for you guys um in the fall haul there's still one more video i have to film tomorrow um before i can like set everything out but i set everything out that i had hauled in the last two um home decor fall home decor videos along with all of the decor that i had that still fits in the color scheme that i'm not giving away to my brother and sister-in-law and you guys i'm really excited i put up two um instagram stories today um kind of like showcasing a little bit of it but i'm so excited you guys like it's gonna look so nice and so pretty and yeah i just love the color scheme that i'm going with i'm also thinking about christmas in the back of my head i've already got a um a, a list in my phone of the things I need to get and I need to head probably to Walmart as soon as they part start putting out their Christmas ornaments and also the at-home store and then I need to find some really pretty um, ribbon too because I want to do a cluster of three trees and I'm going to need way more um, ornaments and all that stuff so yeah Ronnie's going to kill me because with putting up three trees I'm going to need probably triple the amount of ornaments I have which means more storage bins which means more storage space so we're going to have to get one of those garage overhead organizers like we've been putting it off but I just need I need it um so yeah but anyway um that is what is going on I took out all of my fall decor and I'm ready to decorate and everything I just got to film that last home decor haul for you guys so I'm really really excited about that fall time I had said I wasn't going to decorate for fall and then I started going into stores and I started seeing so much in my color scheme on the main level and I was just like I wonder if I should just get it this year because I don't know every year if they're going to you know have the blues and stuff like that I know they'll have the silvers and the whites and stuff like that but I saw a lot of blues and like grays and stuff and I was just like dang like I probably need to get some of this stuff you know so I'm excited that I did the pillows I'm just gonna use them for years to come now you guys are gonna be tired because once you see me decorate this year it's probably going to be pretty much the same next year maybe I might add a room or two um but yeah like I'm not changing my fall decor out for years to come because I love the blue on the main level and it's staying so anyway um I'm rambling it's been 14 minutes so I will um talk to you guys in whatever the next clip is but like I said baby girl and I are headed to the mall she's already asleep for her nap it's already it's only 10 43 but the mall opens at 11 so we'll be there probably at like 11 15 ish and yeah um I will show you guys what I get um from Bath and Body Works hopefully they're pretty well stocked but we'll see because this is the second day of the sale but I just need to get some um wallflowers because refills because I'm going to use them for the holiday season. But all right. Talk to you guys later. Bye.
Sorry, how are you? Okay, you guys, so I'm finally in Target and I have found the display of Mrs. Myers. I've been wanting to try this for a long time. I've heard good things and they have limited edition scents. So I am an apple cider fan. So I want to try the apple cider hand soap. I want to try the dish soap. I usually use the dish soap though for to wash my hands. I don't have a separate hand thing. But maybe I'll use that. And then I also got this to spray. But I want to smell it. So I'm about to smell it, you guys. Okay, guys, I am back home. I wanted to show you guys what I got. Baby girl is eating her dinner. She has a little bit of fried chicken wings, some mac and cheese, some... Are you going to tell them? <laughs> some cabbage and then some greens um, from what we had yesterday and then ronnie um actually meal prepped on the grill today so we have that for the week but i had accidentally bought i bought her some of these to get her through this next season i was supposed to be buying two packs of the long sleeve but i accidentally bought one pack i bought two packs of long sleeve but i bought an 18 month and a 12 month so i returned to 12 month today and i thought i was getting a second pack of long sleeve but it looks like i got short sleeve because I don't be paying attention so now she has one pack of long sleeve and one pack of short sleeve and then um next week I'll probably go back and get her another pack of short sleeve and another pack of long sleeve just so she'll have enough for the fall season because you guys know I don't do laundry like every week and then I picked up this because I've never tried this brand before and I hear so many people talk about it Mrs. Myers and this is the apple cider scent it smells so good so I picked up all three things in the line I have been spraying the cabinets I can't stop spraying this. It smells so good. Like, so I got the hand soap, um, which I'm gonna put in the empty one over there. I don't know if you guys can see that. I usually put hand lotion in that one and just use the dish soap as um, hand soap, but I actually bought the hand soap this time. So I'm going to put that in the empty one. And then um, this is dish soap. So it looks like Ronnie just refilled that because it was like all the way low yesterday. Um, so I'll either pour that out and pour that into something and use this or just wait until the blue is gone, which will probably be next weekend. Um, and then I had bought this a while ago. She had one pack of these and I saw these on clearance um, at Marshall. So I went ahead and picked it up and she does use it. As you can see, she's using it now, but she prefers to drink from a straw. So I got this and I was like, I wonder if this is too advanced for her because it says 12 months. Y'all, why did I forget that it, she's 13 months now? Like, I be acting I I can like she is still a baby. She's not. Like, <laughs> this says four months plus. Um, but it has the flexi spout. She really likes the actual drinking out of straws. She prefers that. So I got these. And it says no leaks and no mess. So hopefully it won't spill. But I got these from Marshalls as well. And they were $7.99. And then um, this I picked up from Amazon and it took like two weeks to come or two and a half weeks to come. It was one of those deals. I think I paid $10 and I got 12 bars of men's soap because Ronnie had ran out of soap. I always get um, deals like this and then I'll get like my Dove body wash on a deal where it'll come four or six in a pack. Last time I did the Dove men's care deal and it was body washes, but this time it's bar soap. He said he didn't really care. And this is just the deep clean purifying grains one. He's not picky about soap. So those were delivered today. I also wanted to show you guys that I took all of my um, traditional colored home decor to my brother and sister-in-law's house tonight. And I... Oh, this is the wrong one. Um, took out all of the home decor that I already had. So this was everything that I already had that fit in my color scheme still. Now these are champagne. They don't technically fit, but I just got these from at home like two years ago. As you can see, this, like, the tags are still on them. So I'm keeping them. I like them. And then these are my Z Gallery pumpkins. And honey, they ain't going nowhere. So 
yeah i actually diy these like years ago in our old single family house and then these are from the target dollar spot um years ago and i never used them so i'm glad i saved those i got some more this year as well this is not everything that i've purchased this is everything i've already had to fit in my color scheme what's wrong baby um and then this is everything that i've purchased that i've already hauled for you guys but y'all i still have a huge section over here um that i have not hauled this is home decor it's not all um fall stuff but it is some fall stuff in here minus baby girl's diapers um yeah so i've been buying her you see a coat and there's pillows and there's just a lot of stuff in here so i'll um show you guys that stuff is some stuff on the table the table's a mess but i did go ahead and take everything else that i had already shown you guys for fall and put it out there so i can see what i have i've already started christmas shopping as you can see and then oh i purchased some um bath and body works candles and then i also put that'll be in the hall um but i will show you guys what i got from bath and body works what's wrong baby girl what's wrong you finished you didn't eat anything except the chicken mama you don't want no more i had to wake her up to eat because she'll wake up in the middle of the night want some greens You want some more? Wawa? Okay, I'll get you some water. So, let me show you guys. I Today was Wallflower Day, so they were all $3.25. So, I think I got like 13 of them. So, let me show you what I got. And I got these so that I can... One of them is leaking, I guess. I don't know where that came from. But anyway, um, I smell one of them. They smell really good. I got two of the mahogany teak wood high intensities for the basement and i got these to re um to replenish whatever i use this holiday season when we are hosting i got two laundry days because i just wanted to smell those and put them in the laundry room um i got one champagne toast i wanted to put this in my closet but i don't think i have an outlet in there so if i can't find one in there i'll just put it on my side of the bathroom and then i did get two fresh cottons she split them up and into these bags i need these papers hold on baby i'm gonna get you some water for a second so that's one fresh cotton over there and then uh -oh, one of these is a fresh cotton i thought here's the other fresh cotton i got two of the um stress relief eu eucalyptus and spearmint i really like that candle i got two of the linen and lavenders because y'all know i like my clean scent and then i got two of the sun drenched linen so this is all that i got i got about 13 i think um, and this was, how much did I pay? With the sale and with Maryland state tax, which is 6%, I paid $44.79. So I'm good. I don't need any more of these because I have a drawer with pretty much this amount in it already. But I'll probably use them when we host Christmas. So now I have my stash to replenish that. But yeah, you guys, get into it. I cannot wait. Tomorrow I'm going to start decorating. I've got to film one more home decor haul in the morning. By the time you see this vlog, all this stuff will be live. So go check it out on my channel. The Decorate With Me is all three home decor hauls and all that stuff. But tomorrow morning, I'm going to get up and I'm going to film the last home decor haul so that I can add that stuff to this. And then I'm going to start decorating. I'll probably start in my entryway and just do like the bench entryway and then move into the family room over there and then in here and maybe do a little bit in the kitchen but this those are the only four spaces that i'm going to decorate this year and then i'll add to my um collection every year hopefully they'll bring back these colors the reason i'm not starting in here which i probably would have preferred to start in here is i decided to stack everything in here so i would have to move all the stuff in order to decorate it so i'll just decorate in here last and pull from it those pumpkins right there are giving me life i absolutely love them they're so beautiful they remind me of the pumpkins on here, which are the Ray Dunn ones. So pretty. Um, but yeah, everything is really, really pretty. The silvers, the blues, the whites, the grays. It's going to be so pretty. Now, the stems. I, I did buy some smaller pumpkins as well. With um, like these stems, I'm okay with because they're dark and but they're not like gold or brown. This one I don't like, and then I have some smaller ones that I purchased from the Target Dollar Spot, and I think they have the brown stems as well. I kind of want to paint them kind of white, I think. I think, and I think I have some craft paint. Let me go look. It may be downstairs, but I think I have some craft paint 
that I can paint those white because I ain't feeling I ain't feeling that color so we'll see but y'all get into it not my broom but get into it you see those pillows over there oh my goodness and it's two stacked on top of each other and then I have those two small ones I finally bought three white candles for these rings right here they're right there I may not leave these rings on the table for um for um fall time I may put them in the formal dining room and do something else but I don't know what I'm going to do originally I wanted to put this runner on the top of over there but it may not need it so I may be able to use my runner right here um, but I did have a, a white furry runner that I usually use for Christmas and fall that I wanted to use over here so I don't know um but yeah I'm excited and you guys I still have not found my blue pumpkin stems all I have is two of the um, brown ones I'm not brown ones um gray ones with the brown stem so I'm just gonna have to use those and come up with something because I can't find the blue ones you guys bought them all up so yeah but I'm super super excited to start decorating for fall you guys this is my vibe this is my my fall vibe right here it's looking beautiful look at these I found all of these I thought I had two of these but maybe not but I know I had two of these and then I had the big one it's just so pretty but I was so happy to give all that stuff to my sister-in-law today. She was so happy to receive it. So all is well. I've never actually used this one before. I think I sat this one out um, for a centerpiece one time. But I do have some that are bigger than this that I got from Burlington that have like a pink undertone to them. But I'm not going to use them this year um, unless I put some stuff down in my like beauty slash filming studio because pink is not up here and before i would put all the pink stuff i have pink pumpkins and stuff from pier one and a pink owl and they just look really really pretty um but i used to put that in the entryway of my townhouse but since i'm not really doing the pink anywhere in here it didn't make sense for me to bring that stuff out so that's still in the bin ronnie put it back downstairs and it, i probably won't decorate my studio this year because I'm not finished even decorating it at all permanently. So I do still have that stuff. I did not give that the, the pretty pink stuff away. I'll just use that downstairs and maybe when she gets a little older, I'll put it in her room as well because she has pink in there. But all of this stuff I already had and I'm really, really excited to decorate with it. This year, I didn't buy any like turkeys or anything or any owls. I just bought everything you see over there and I bought a lot of pumpkins to kind of add to my collection. Um, I am so happy that these are still doing good. I made these so long ago, like all three of these um, from Dollar Tree pumpkins and stuff. That was a DIY. And that video still does really, really good um, even to this day. But anyway, um, I absolutely love all of the pumpkins that I decided to keep. I actually decided to keep these as well. I got these from the at-home store a long time ago. I would love to get some um, silver ones or some gray ones i did get these um ceramic ones from hobby lobby but i would love to get like a box of the silver or gray ones but maybe next year but i have a lot of pumpkins you guys now i did not realize that i don't have any white pumpkins the only white one i have is here so next year i'll keep that in mind i have this one that says hello fall um, which is really pretty but i don't have any white pumpkins so next year i did buy some small white ones and some small blue ones this year i'm gonna haul those and then those will come out but i didn't actually buy any white pumpkins so next year maybe i'll add to my collection and scoop up some white ones when i see them because i have enough grays and blues i think so yeah what wrong baby girl look at baby girl ronnie moisturized our hair while i was gone i went to a birthday um dinner today what's wrong you want to get out you didn't eat you're not hungry mama say hi to the people <laughs> look at you she usually will throw it on the floor if she don't want it so i can't complain y'all look at her She's so bad. <laughs> okay so you guys these were the sauces i was telling you guys about from like tj maxx and marshall's so i got this one from marshall's i haven't opened it yet but ronnie used this one last night he said it was really really good they're like 3.99 and 4.99 at um Marshalls and Home Goods. These two came from Home Goods. They were $3.99. I haven't tried these yet, um, but this one he said was really good. I'm about to try the truffle aioli sauce. Um, or maybe I should just try the pesto because he said it was good. Um, but he grilled some food yesterday. He grilled these peppers and um, chicken breast. And I'm going to try one of these two on my 
grilled peppers and chicken. I'm not sure which one. Probably the truffle. Why not? <laughs> but they're really good. So if you guys see them in Marshalls or um, Home Goods, uh, try some and pick one up. And let me know how you like it. They're by the brand Terrapin Ridge Farms.